I'm Brandon Johnson. Uh, I am a, an administrator in the school district uh, in the DFW area. I'm Danny Johnson. Um, I also went to TCU, so um, Fort Worth's home for us, definitely. I'm 36, and I'm a nurse at a, a uh, children's hospital here. We have a six-year-old Olivia, um, and then we have a four-year-old Knox. Um, they are both just wild and crazy, um, but God's blessed us to be their parents, and it's been awesome. I uh, wouldn't change it for the world. It's just loving life right now. Like COVID's been interesting. I feel like a lot of people, um, it's brought a lot of people apart or brought them together. And I definitely think we've gotten closer because of it. Um, um, having the kids home was interesting. Not having any free time on our own was um, difficult and a, an adjustment. Um, I struggle. But, but the coolest thing is uh, I went from wearing a suit every day to like wearing like t-shirt shorts and pajamas and um, and, and sometimes you know maybe I, I should have worn a little bit of something more professional <laughs> but I didn't have my camera on so it didn't matter. Well and the commute just taking that piece away from it like we got we got them a lot more I mean it's an extra it's a 45 minute one way so we got them home an extra hour and a half a day which is really nice. I don't remember the exact first time I ever saw Atlanta stuff, um, but I, I immediately fell in love with it. I love the bright color, I love the movement, and I would always be like showing him like, oh look at this painting, or oh look at this product. So, you know, she brought home this tray and I was like, what is that? And so I'm looking at it, I'm like, we just bought this tray of art, like what are we going to use it for? So a little bit of time went by and she was like, see we can use it this way, or this way, or this way, and I just never thought that it, we we currently use it as our uh, our coffee bar tray, where we have all of our um, coffee stuff. And every morning when we make coffee, we'll, <laughs> I look at that tray, and I never thought it would become such a staple in our li our daily lives. Last Christmas, uh, I looked into um, purchasing a piece. Uh, there were several pieces that she liked, and you know we hit the pandemic, and um, you know she's trying to get the house together and thinking about what she really envisions. Uh, for this for the space to look like and um, she wanted to commission a painting and so I was all for it. Okay tell me a couple of spots that you are thinking about for the artwork. Um, so either above our bed or um, I need something bright in here. Okay so in the kitchen area. As far as the process like I sent you a whole bunch of pictures of stuff that I'd liked uh, of your pieces and then a couple of things that we already had in the house and then I just I, we both believe in just letting people like do what they're good at. I was like, have a go at it. I'll never forget like we were on the beach um, in Alabama and I got to sit there and like watch you make it. Like that was so cool. And and we have the link that we can go back and like just see how that whole process works. And I think that's so neat. Um, I think the number one word that comes to me is just joy. Like it's just a happy painting. Um, and I think a lot of your artwork is is very just. You look at it, and it's like, how can you be in a bad mood? You know, so the fact that we get to eat dinner is is really awesome. Because of the open space uh, that is that room, it really just kind of brightens the whole thing up. We purposely designed the house, it's very basic, and so we wanted to bring that color and that art in, um, or the color in through artwork. Um, and you're one of the first people I thought of to do it. 